I am Maria Ruiz Alonso, Endometrio Director working at Igenomics, part of Vitrolife Group. I'm Tamar Barbakadze, OBGYN, Reproductive Endocrinologist, Head of the Fertility Department at Georgian American Center, ReproArt. Tamar, what are your thoughts uh, on recurrent implantation failure in IVF? So, recurrent implantation failure is a core, a core problem uh, in IVF uh, during IVF treatment of any age patients, especially in advanced age uh, where the multidimensional changes of endometrial receptivity is aff affects the results. And it's not easy to suggest patients to try another transfer and we need some additional option uh, to suggest patients to, uh, for improving their results so to, to optimize their next attempt. So it's really a huge problem. In, uh, IVF in the uh, reproductive field. So. As you have pointed out, uh, recurrent implantation failure is a crucial problem in IVF. This study is the first and only RCT study in ERA in this indicated population. So can you summarize your main findings? Uh, thank you. So uh, we conducted this study uh, because of uh, a RIF problem, recurrent implantation failure problem because uh, as, I, as I mentioned, this is uh, one of the core problems and we, we, uh, the patient requires some solution uh, to move forward and to improve their results. So a study was conducted uh, from 2020 to 2023 and uh, there was uh, three main groups, so up to 35 advanced age patients and the group uh, under 35. So the group which we are up to 35, there was a two different group. So one group was using egg donation, PGTA and ERA. Then another group of advanced age patient, we are using the egg donation and PGTA only. The younger group patient was a specially selected patient to compare results of all no sites, ERA and PGTA results. But the advanced age patient was randomized blindly. And we finally we found that patient group who were using egg donation, PGTA and DRA had a higher uh, reproductive outcome, so high pregnancy rate, implantation rate and delivery rate. And the patient who had, this was approximately 77 and 9 percent, and the patient who we are using, advanced age patient who were utilizing egg donation, PGTA only, they had a 57 uh, percent of pregnancy rate. So it was statistically significant difference. And the implantation rate and delivery rate, live birth rate was higher in PGTA egg donation and ERA group. And the interesting is that uh, young gauge patient where we are using the onocyte ERA and PGTA, we got get this, uh, got the same results we, which we had in advanced age patient with egg donation. So it's really important to have a comparable uh, results among advanced age patients and young age patients. Even using with egg donation, we, uh, advanced age patients is struggling with implantation failures. Uh, it shows a quite optimistic, uh, I would say, results uh, to, uh, to use a ERA in advanced age patients for optimizing outcome of IVF. So these are uh, very interesting results. Um, I wanted to ask you why you choose uh, the test ERA for this study. Okay, uh, thank you for asking. First of all, it's a uh, one of uh, best strategic decisions when we are the planning uh, treatment in ad of advanced age patient, IVF treatment of advanced age patient. And ERA had a, a most uh, valuable uh, previous uh, results and pay so, so studies uh, which I trust and that's why I choose ERA for treatment of advanced age patient. And as our study shows that it really improves results of advanced age patients. That was a reason why I chose uh, ERA for my RCT and it showed re really truly a uh, better outcomes even with young, age, with young age and even with advanced age patients. Thank you Tamar uh, for your work with this RCT. Uh, your finding offer a solution for patients suffering uh, with recurrent implantation failure and we look forward to keep hearing from you and from new works from you and your colleagues. 
Thank you, Maria, for your interest. We are happy from eGenomics, part of Vitrolife Group, to share with you uh, these new findings about ERA test. And thank you for watching this video.